here we are in Tucson, Arizona for our fourth event in the No Prep Kings Invitational Race Series. Just a few minutes south of Interstate 10, located on the Pima County Fairgrounds, Tucson Dragway is one of the nation's most active drag racing facilities. Throughout the year, they hold a ton of race events, including the Fall Fuel Extravaganza, the Summit Series Team Races, and Drag Weekend West. The weather here is great, but being in the middle of the desert means this track gets dusty, and in the no prep world, that just means another layer of difficulty getting to the finish line. Our 32 racers have just arrived and are already getting ready to compete for a cash prize of $40,000. Before our event kicks off in the morning, we're gonna give everyone a chance to do a little bit of grudge racing, collect some data so they can use in round one tomorrow morning. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Fireball versus the Dead Trap. Get on your feet, folks, this is gonna be a good one. a close one. I normally don't have any problems going A to B, but the fact that I spun out and almost crashed my car means we're all gonna have to be extra careful out there because this track is extra sketchy. Sean Wilhoyt in the mistress. Randy Williams in purple rain all the way from Kansas. Here we go. This should be a good one, folks. one of the worst wrecks I've ever seen in drag racing. This desert dust gives a whole new level of difficulty. Too little of power and you lose the race. Too much power and you slip and slide all the way down the racetrack. I guess Bodie had some issues with his car last night and they stayed up all night working on a fuel system or something. So he's kind of going untested. We're struggling right now. We're rushing. We got we got a whole crew busting ass trying to get this fuel line done. Ready? Rock and roll. Gangster. It's all good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. First round call out. Doc, with his Morgan and Son power, gonna take on the twin turbo of Bodie. Here we go, Bodie's bumping him in. First race of the day, and Bodie's car is all over the place, sliding down the track. We knew it was slick out there, and he just proved it. Up next is Ryan Hall versus Bobby DeCody. Bobby surprised us all when he made it to the finals in Edinburgh. Let's see how he does on this track. All right. First round, I call that Bobby DeCody, 2,500. My car's running all the way at full tilt. I know I can outrun him. We lost a cylinder last night, worked all night thrashing on the car. Discovered this morning we had two cylinders down. So we got two dead cylinders. We're gonna run it on six. I'm still gonna send it to the moon. First round of drivers meeting. Ryan Hall comes chirping his big tall ass on me again. Say he wants to run me for 2,500 for second pair down. You know, I took that. That's more money in the bank for me, babe. Bobby DeCody, little legend. In the left lane, Ryan Hall in the right lane. the next round. Up next, we have Reaper running Ruben Ybarra. Reaper has rewrapped his car, he's had trouble launching lately, and hopefully he's got it ironed out because he's one of the 405ers. Ruben Ybarra all the way from Brownsville, Texas. Feel a little bit nervous because we thrashed all night with the car, got it done this morning. We're kind of sketchy about it, but we're gonna do the best we can. Let's see if he got it. 
Oh, yeah. We're going to run right the fuck over that guy. Called out Shannon Poole, uh, also known as Big Dookie. He's got a beautiful Corvette. Probably weighs 1,600 pounds. Going up against my 3,200-pound street car. It's a long drive home to know you got ran over by a 3,200-pound small tire car. Shannon Poole taking on Eric Bain in Boosted Ego. Up next is Jason Lancaster versus Amarillo Mike. My name's Mike Lamberson. I'm from Amarillo, Texas. They call me Amarillo Mike. I drive a 79 Z28 Camaro. I've changed my whole setup to get more aggressive after it because last race I got beat by Ryan Martin. All right, here comes Jason Lancaster in the unicorn in the right lane. the win. Scott Taylor coming up. Jerry Bird from New Orleans, Louisiana. Jerry Bird is now in front of Wiggles around. Oh, no. I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good, bro. I know. I know. The tree came down, left the starting line. The car went straight as an arrow. I look over on the left. I see Jerry coming at me. It's like he's half in the air and half on the ground. I was trying to reach up and grab the chute because I felt him moving around. I couldn't find the handle. It just, I mean, it happened so quick, though. You know, next thing I know, I was, you know, it's like the car just flipped over and was on the roof. You know, it was brand new. It was. Beautiful car, and now it's a wrecked piece of. Shit. <laughs> All right, well. 